Hi guys, it's Jo here. I am just waiting at the station, about to get the train into the city to see some, have some lunch with the ladies. Now I know something like this, um, for those of us who've got food intolerances, going out to lunch can be something that's a little bit scary. Um, it should be enjoyable, so I, I'm actually not feeling too bad about this. And what I've done, firstly, I've had a low FODMAP snack just before I've left home. So that's taken the edge off my hunger. It means that when I get there, I'm not gonna be starving hungry and wanting to eat everything that's sitting on the table in front of me. Um, the other thing that I've done this morning, I have jumped on the internet. I've had a look at the menu of the place where we're going to go. And I've had a look to see what sort of foods they've got, what they have. And I actually managed to find a really delicious looking, it's um, a said tuna salad with potatoes and things which looks like it's going to be relatively easy to make low FODMAP. So I jumped on the telephone, I rang up, I had a bit of a chat to them. It turns out that there is a bit of onion in the salad and they can easily leave that out for me. Um, or even if they didn't, that's something we don't need to worry about cross-contamination. So onion is something that I can easily pick out. Um, the other thing that I spoke to them about is the dressing and they do tell me that there is a little bit of garlic in the dressing so what the chefs agreed to do for me is make me a um, nice light olive oil based balsamic dressing to go on it so um, that means that my salad and my salad dressing is all going to be low FODMAP I've got a really delicious light lunch because it's 34 degrees today in Melbourne I think for those of you in the US that's sitting up around the hundreds um, high 90s to 100s so it's pretty warm nice light lunch tuna salad is going to be delicious and I'm not at all nervous I'm looking forward to having lunch with um, the ladies anyway I hope everybody has a great day and I'll see you all soon bye